we play. We fight. We conquer. Welcome back to the Freak Show. I am your host, Bumpy McSquiggums, and today we're diving back on into the OG Fire Emblem. Fire Emblem, the Shadow Dragon, the Blade of Light. It is just a bit over 20, sorry, 31 years since the original Fire Emblem was released. I believe it released back in 1990 on the 20th of April. So I'm recording this a couple days after that. So 21 years on, this is what games look like, or sorry, 31 years on. This is what games look like 31 years ago. Crazy, crazy to think that. See, I keep wanting to revert back to the 21 years, but that's completely different time. Okay, let's um, let's look at the map. That's not what I. There we go. So that's not the button I thought I hit. There is a large amount of horsey boys over here and hoisey goils, hoist goils. Uh, so yeah, that's a tiny bit terrifying. But uh, well. It does not appear that we have a named individual in this giant pile of just death and destruction. Oh, what do we have over here? A whole bunch of knights. I am going to assume also we're not going to have any... Oh, I was wrong. We got a Roger. We got a Roger, Roger. Roger, 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 Roger. Okay, I'll stop. So we've lost Barst up to this point. I forgot to bring Merrick in the last battle. So he did not get a chance to level up or do anything of the sort. And where's our eventual end? This is it over here. It's cannibal. It's a carnival or a cannibal. I don't know. Well, I mean, this is actually kind of horrifying. If you think about it, this is not a, easy task well Martha's coming no matter what Draug is going to be of course joining us Gordon, Seda, Castor, Julian, Navarre and probably Harden we're not going to forget well we're going to bring Wendell of course Abel, Cain Daros, Bantu I can bring oh no uh, I guess Daros is getting sidelined I need to bring my boy Merrick. Huh. Am I being too heavy-handed with my... With my knights? Should I bring something other than... Should I bring board, maybe? Or Daros? I mean, I don't think I need Kane and Abel. And also Harden. Oh, that's, that's a tough one. I'm just going to roll with what I have. And we're going to hope for the best. Prince Marth, we are mercenaries hired to protect Port Warren. Grust has gathered its forces in the northern fortresses. They have put the port to siege. It's very dangerous here, but there is a castle to the east that looks a bit safer. We should make it our target. Let's head there together without delay. Oh, are these the dudes? We got Rad, and we got Cesar, or Caesar. That's kind of cool. Mercenary, mercenary. Is Navarre also a mercenary? He is. Oh boy. Yeah, I don't I don't really know how this is going to go. Like that's some really scary times, man. Just the, the sheer number of ranged units coming at us is a bit much. What are these things? What this? Welcome to Alara Bells. Take a look at what's on sale. Oh. Oh. Oh, we, we absolutely need to go here. Oh, my goodness. Um. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. 
Uh, I would like more, yes. I would like a fire and a thunder. Yeah, it's totally cool. I'm going to be hooking Wendell up with some uh, new digs, so to speak. All right. Thank you. All right. Well, that's pretty cool. What else do we have here? Clarabelle's exactly the same thing. Okay. And then I'm going to assume all of these are basically the same. Or maybe they have slightly different items. <gasps> we have a new rapier. New rapier. Uh, steel sword. Good. We're going to have to do some, some acquisitions here. This might take us a little bit just to, to do the shopping. The silver lance is there. It's expensive. But, I mean, we've got so much money at this point. Um, I'd say we can go like iron sword, steel sword, rapier. I mean, like we can just buy some stuff at this point. Like there's, there's nothing that's going to stop us from getting this. And we can put a lot of it into the, into the caravan. Uh, I know we can't use it. I am aware. All right. So they have utilized their stuff. There's also an arena here. Now, the the problem is, before we really can utilize the arena, we should maybe secure something. All right, what are you, what are you rocking right now, Marth, buddy? Iron Sword and your Rapier, they're both a little bit on the light side, but the fact that we can get more Rapiers is real nice. The fact that you only have an Iron Sword, not a Lance, is a little bit underwhelming as well. Harden, Steel Sword, and a Silver Lance, I think you're pretty set. We'll move you up. I believe all of our Archerians are okay. Yeah, they're good. And by all, I mean there's two of them, right? I don't actually remember this map when I last played. I suppose I do remember Roger, because I think Drow got dropped in, like, the next map or something. So, like, I vaguely remember that. <sighs> and I think we're going to probably use... Cain, maybe, to transfer some items over. I'm going to go here. I assume it's the same. Yeah. I think we're going to go with the steel sword. And I'd, I sort of want to get a silver lance. I don't know that we can use it yet, but I think I'm going to buy it anyway. All right, and then that should max us out. Wendell is probably going to struggle a bit, but I think we'll be okay. Get able to get in there a little bit deeper. Sometimes it's just like, I don't know. Uh, I think there's a, a small amount of me rushing a little bit faster further, faster than I should due to the nature of, you know, the Let's Play. Because I I want to show everything on camera, but at the same time, there's a lot of stuff that's super boring and really, really slow. Like, any time that we have to move people around the map that's, like, super far behind, that's a real slow time. And there's a bunch of other little things, but I feel like I would probably do a little bit better. Uh, and not... Uh, not that we've been doing badly, but, um, like, I would take the time to actually outfit my folks and have them all set up and ready to go before moving too far ahead. I, I'm probably gonna, honestly, chill here with Wendell. Let them, uh, catch up and swap and all that stuff. Merrick is probably fine. He's still got his, I would say his encyclopedia, his Excalibur. I don't know. Um, you're a bit low, but you've got enough to do some work. We're going to have to rely on quite a bit of luck, I feel, on this map in general. Uh, let's see what happens. Maybe something good's going to happen and, like, some of the enemy will just dissipate and disappear and just not be around anymore. Maybe not. 
Well, there's Roger. I don't know who we're going to need to bring. Oh, God. This just seems like a, a bad plan altogether. I think any of them had armor slayers? I should check that. I'm going to need Draug up near the front because he's going to have to kind of hold the line. And honestly, we're probably going to have to sit back and wait. This is, this is a little stressful. I'm not going to lie. I'm going to assume they're going to roll out on us. Cannot guarantee that's going to be how this goes, but I think I'm going to actually back it up. I'm glad I went far enough forward with Hardin that um, looks like we at least triggered them, but yeah, I'm a little concerned. All right, can you meet with Wendell? You can, perfect. All right. Let's go with our item. Let's go with Thunder. We'll trade it. Um, can I also give you another... Can I give you a fire spell? I don't think I can. No, I think you're... And I don't think it's because you can't take the fire spell. I think it's because you're full up. Alright, Rad, as much as your name is, is pretty cool, I'm afraid you're going to end up having to kind of sit this out a little bit. Items stored here can be retrieved at other convoys. Do you like? I would like to store some stuff. Uh, we'll do one of the iron swords. We're going to store a rapier. So what I think might happen is whenever we finish up this episode, I think I wherever we're at, I'm going to try to get to the point where we actually defeat the giant mass of people above us. Granted, we're 12 minutes in. We haven't touched anyone yet. Um, I'm going to try to get to that point. And if I'm able to, I think that will be incredibly good for us because I, at that point, will do all this other moving around stuff and outfitting people off camera. So it's not just like a whole episode of me just doing that. And that'll put us in a pretty good spot. But we'll have to wait and see how that all works out. I feel like you could almost just handle that, buddy. Like, we're real close to being able to get this done, but not quite. So if we move you there, can we get... Draug up to... Okay. I think we're going to be okay here. You know what? Let's put Caster there. I'm sure Caster can make it back and do some stuff. Many foes wait inside the fortresses, ready to enter the battle. We'll block them so they can't get out. Wait, what? These things? Oh. That's okay. I sure. A little worried about sending you up there, buddy, but you know what? we got this. Ideally, I would have... Uh, I don't know. I don't know what the ideal situation here would be, to be honest. I think we're in about as good of a position as we can get in. We'll have to see how this all kind of plays out as we go. I'd like to get Bantu up there as well. Maybe a little bit behind, but he'll be able to hit it next time around. Merrick's on his way as well, so that should help us. I think we're okay. All right. Let's see what you got. Oh, they're actually moving everybody forward. Okay. Not what I was expecting. We 
Really? Well, they're gonna shoot at Marth. I mean, I, I, I'm fine with that, I suppose. Mm, okay, Navar. Sure. I'm actually fine. Really? I'm still fine with all these things. This is actually probably the best possible scenario. Nope. Best possible scenario? Who are you gonna hit? Julian. Oh, God. The fact that they got their archer units. Oh, no. Oh, he dodged. Okay. Okay, good, good, good. okay so miscalculated. I guess when they no longer have to like walk over the forest terrain, and they can walk over their own people, it probably changes how they move, is my guess. I'm not sure that's true, but that's the best guess I have. All right, well, let's see. Is, that's not... Oh, it is Roger. Okay. I just, out of curiosity, want to see... Is it you? Yes. Okay, so she is the one who must speak. Oh, God, how do we fix this? Um, there's a lot. Steel bow. Let's go ahead and take that shot. Get him, Gordon. That is really underwhelming. Real underwhelming, buddy. Julian, you need to not get got, so please leave. Alright, we're going to attack. I guess we'll use the bow gun. Okay, seven damage. Oh, and a fall. Oh my god, we crit. Why is Caster so much better than Gordon? I just don't get it. He can move further, he does more damage, like... The dude's got the skills to pay the bills. Like, in a pretty substantial way. Why can't I traverse the mountainside over there? Well, can Navar do that? Yes, Navar can. Alright, that's actually really good. Alright, I think we're gonna go Steel Sword. Killing Edge did call to me. Oh, no, well, never mind. Because I wanted the crit, and then we just crit with the steel sword. Alright, that's that's cool. I like that. That makes me happy. Alright, we can get Bantu up here. The problem is the, the, the big heavies have the have the archers behind them. So the big heavies here have the archers behind, which means that our gal is at risk constantly. And that's kind of spooky scary times a little bit. Can't waddle my way over with you. I don't think Wendell can reach to do anything. No, Wendell's a little bit... He's got stubby leg syndrome right now. Uh, it's fine. Merrick can definitely do some damage. Um, I don't know where I want to use... I think I'm going to do it this way. Steel sword's probably fine. Well, we missed our first attack. We definitely didn't miss the second one. Alright, Seda did some work there. Marth's gonna step up, and I suppose we'll go through the rapier. We have another one that we can acquire. That did not do much. That's kind of crappy. Um was not anticipating failing on that front. Um, alright. That's still, well... Crap, that might be a problem. Uh, we'll, we'll see. We'll see if that's a problem. I suppose we'll do this. Oh. Oh. He got the nod. Oh. 
Okay, not what I was expecting. Alright, friend. Get him now. Please don't miss. Oh, thank goodness. Alright, so my, my main issue at this point is we have to take down this guy. And we didn't do it. Oh, boy. Okay, that, that's a problem. That might not be a problem. Oh, thank goodness. Okay. Okay, the reason that was as important as it was is uh, I don't know, but could have targeted her. And she, again, does not do well when targeted by things that go pew 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 and we don't, you know, want to die. A few of our folks are a little bit banged up, a little bit hurt. Not horribly so. We're actually just fine with what he's got on himself. Like, he doesn't really change much. What do you, what do you bring to the table? Oh, the heal. Okay, the heal and the fire. Meanwhile, back over here. I think I did that one. Let's uh, let's go to this one. I mean, they're they're, they're probably they're probably all the same, you know. Yeah, they seem to be. I'm gonna get a couple of these. No, no, no! I don't want the iron sword. A couple of these. And I I already hear it. Uh, steel. I suppose one more lance wouldn't be too bad. Alright, so he's full up. I think we survive all of these attacks? Probably? So one guy's gonna step into the woods. Oh, interesting. Oh, yeah, step into the woods. And then Martha's just gonna, I thought for sure, finish him. And then this is gonna do mostly nothing, I can only assume. It didn't do much. Okay, I think we're fine. I think we're actually totally fine. Uh, Roger, if I'm not wrong, based off of everything that we've done thus far. Oh, oh okay. Should be this guy right here. It is. All right, which means Seda can talk to him. Um, I won't say 100% safely, but relatively safely. Hello there, I am Seda of uh, Telus, and I come in peace. Ah, you caught me off guard calling out like that. What do you want? I have a question for you. Do you believe in love? Is there someone that matters to you? What? 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 What, what kind of question is that? I apologize. You look very kind. And I thought, hmm, we might have a chat. Do you mind telling me your name? Uh, well, um, the, the, the name's Roger. Uh, Roger of Grust. Roger, I want you to think about something. Those who cry because of war. We in the Arcanian League wish to put an end to fighting. To this sadness. Surely you can understand this. Uh, of course I do. I, I don't fight because I enjoy it, but I can't betray my homeland. Is there someone precious to you in Grust? Uh, my parents have passed on, and I am unmarried, but betraying my homeland is out of the question. So what I ask is impossible? I am sorry to say so, but yes. Sorry, folks. Uh, still, I was glad to speak. You are the man I expected. I was glad to speak. That's weird. Oh, you're leaving. Then... I must. If I stay with you too long, your comrades might think you a turncoat. 
You are too kind. Why can't I meet someone like you in Grust? Hey, wait a moment. I... I don't want you to leave. I am on my own, so I will join you. What? <laughs> it's just as ridiculous the second time around. I remember that dialogue. Well, fans tr fan translated dialogue like that. Rough times. That was that was real weird. All right, you got a lance. Does I need to be a f like super afraid of anyone else? Don't seem to be. Ah. Uh. Level 5 is Draug level 5 as well. Yeah, we got we doubled down on our level 5s. Except Roger's got one more HP. Therefore, it is known that he is the greater of the two. Speaking of greater of the two, we are going to staff it up and throw a heal out on good old Marthy Marth. Alright. Let's get our dragon boy out here, ready to breathe some fire on some fools. I love the fact that the Firestone doesn't have any kind of spookums thing. 32 points of experience. I like that a lot. How you feeling? You feeling okay? Cool. Hmm... Really kind of need to move. Well, you know what? I already know who I want to move up, so let's just do it now. We'll stick with the rapier. Pfft, just demolishing fools. Just look at this. Look at, look, 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 look at him. Look at him getting whooped. It's level 7. Increasing our strength, our skill, our luck, and our defense. It is good times that is being had by all. Quite literally. And maybe even sort of figuratively. Um, hmm. We could front line with Roger, probably. Yeah, I think we'll go after this guy. Roger and a uh, drug. Uh, he's kind of getting slapped around a little bit. Maybe I should be a bit more concerned putting him on the on the front lines there. I'm going to move you out of the way slightly. I'm also going to put you up here. You know, no, I'm not. No, I'm not. No, no, no. You're fine. You're fine. Stay where you're at. Uh, do we? We're going to try it. We're going to try We're, we're, we're going to give Gordon a chance again. We're going to get a steel bow out. He's going to shoot at this guy. We're going to hope he does some damage. He did four. That's still incredibly underwhelming. He's only level 4. Caster, where are you at, buddy? Level 7, my god, man. You are a beast amongst everything. Can't go into the mountains with you. Alright, we're gonna wait. I I guess we'll pull Caster down here. Oh, I can't make him go to where I want him to go. Okay, that's fine. We'll visit this. I've heard tell that a princess of Macedon is being held captive in Castle D Deal. Deal? Deal? Uh, Macedon and Dollar are supposed to be allies. I wonder what happened. Sounds like Minerva done got got. Alright, let's throw this attack out. You know we gonna do some damage. Steel sorting it up. One HP. Hardly worth our effort, but hey, you know what? We did it. Navarra is now level 7. His speed has gone up by 1 and max HP by 1. Now we're going to get Merrick over here. Merrick is going to toss out a spell or two. Getting some Blizzardians going. Boop. Boop. And enjoy. Merrick's actually a little hurt. Alright, Raj. What do you got for me, buddy? Got your lance. You're going to attack the other, the other big heavy. Three, okay. I suppose we're fine with that. If we can throw some extra love anyone's way, we will absolutely do so. We're close to Wendell. We'll be able to give him his stuff this next turn, which is great. Let's go ahead and... 
and the turn. And uh, I think we'll stick with it. This might be a little bit of a longer episode where we're going to finish up the guys that are right before us. And I think we'll be fine. They're thinking about how they can attack and approach. I think they're going through just they nothing. Oh, okay. Well, if if I were to come up with an, a, an attack vector, that was not going to be it. Actually, what do you have left? You have heal and fire. I think we're going to put fire on the other guy. On Merrick here. I'll trade this over to you. Oh, you you can't... Are you, are you Hold on, are you full up? Merrick's not full, is he? Oh, he is full. How did... Huh. Well, that's... Okay, that's fine. Not that big of a deal. We'll let Drow take the the kill here. I need to give him a little bit of a heal, though. That experience boost was nice, but might not be enough. Let's throw you out here. The Firestone, let's see what happens. Nice. Now, I assume any melee attacks, that's how that's going to go. I think that's not a melee attack. It might go differently. Oh, you just can't do anything, buddy. Ugh, you're killing me slowly. Can you make it onto the mount? Of course you can. You can do anything. You're a superhero. By comparison. Big ol' hit. Taking him down. Just, just, just... Ugh. Gordon's getting to the point where he may not be coming along for the, the rides for much longer. Kinda, I want to put Roger like in, I don't want to say in like harm's way. That, that doesn't really. Okay, took a little bit of damage there, but like the archers are just not gonna do anything to him, you know. So there's no real like fear that something terrible is gonna happen to him. Come on, I can't do anything. Oh, there we go. Yeah, we'll hit you with an Excalibur. That should be enough to to burn through you real quick. Oh yeah. A single crit there would have been nice, but we gotta level up. Level 4, weapon increased, weapon level increased, max HP. Far is a little bit hurt. I guess Harden can probably come over and... Oh, he can't reach? Alright, well, we'll do this. Steel Sword... Oh. Okay, I'm a little concerned. <gasps> you can make it. Alright, can we actually get some damage on this guy? Is that a possibility? Oh my god, we did two damage. Oh my god. Gordon, dude, you're, you're literally killing me, man. You're literally killing me with your chicanery, man. Come on. Step up your G-A-M-E. Yeah, Navarre taking care of business. I like it. Okay. Now... I'm very concerned. Like, she could just die. Like, a dude be able to move there. A dude be able to... Well, that's really it. I mean, she probably survives one attack, right? Is... 
Is Marth strong enough? Level 9. Skill up by 1. Weapon level and max HP. What level... Marth's... <sighs> I mean, it's risky. It's a little risky. That was very underwhelming. I am not going to lie. Uh, I think we're okay. Again, I'm not positive, but I feel like we're okay. Oh, okay. That's interesting. I... Again, underestimating how far we can move with certain characters. I suppose I'm fine with that. Big hit. Not enough. Dang. Well, you know what? We got one more shot here. I think we javelinize if we can. Oh, I don't think I have... Maybe maybe I have the one with the javelin. Maybe I don't. I do. I do have the one with the javelin. Alright, cool. Let's go with it. It's Abel? Yeah, Abel with the javelin. Yeah! Alright, I should be able to survive three attacks from just about anyone. Level 5, attained, weapon level up, speed luck, and max HP. Pretty good level for us. I'm incredibly concerned about so many things at this point, but we'll see how it goes. Move here. And I think I'm going to throw the heal onto you from good old Wendell here. Yeah, there we go. Wendell's mostly full healed. Alright, we're going to end the turn. We're going to finish these guys off in the next one. They should all just attack Marth. By all accounts. And I feel like Marth should be strong enough to either just dodge outright. Or tank whatever hits. He's so far dodging. Okay, and he only took three. Yeah, he would have been fine. Okay, well, at this point, I think it behooves us to finish these guys off, and then we'll end the old episodic episode. So let's go ahead with the iron sword. Maybe we'll get the double attack on them. Decent. Decent. I'm a little saddened to try this, because I know we're going to hit him, but it's not going to do any damage. Try the steel bow again. Oh my god, he almost killed something. Uh, except he almost also died, so... Uh, he's so bad. He's so bad. This is Roger. Okay, I'll put Roger up here. That lance on someone. Alright, we're fine with that. Uh... Hmm. Well, I suppose we can just throw a, a quick heal to make sure he's okay. Alright, we got that. Uh, let's go with you? I, I know I feel like it's a waste, but we'll go for it. The 1 HP, there it is. Kind of wish I got my thief over to take care of that, to be honest, but eh. Go here, get our attack on with our rapier once again. There we go, a couple of uh, big hits there. Not quite enough to finish them, but a decent amount. Oh, just short. Actually, quite short, to be honest. You can't make it either, can you, Bantu? Oh, no, I'm wrong. Dude just got, like, super sprinty legs. He just made it right over there. No problem whatsoever. Gobble. Oh, he didn't do anything. Oh, that sucked. That wasn't part of the plan. I go for the kill on this guy. Oh my god. Okay, there we go. My my goodness, we are just batting a zero right now. We're missing everything. Uh, 
Yeah, Harden can get over there and slap him from this side, I suppose. I don't think it'll be enough. I wish we had somebody else who could actually reach and do something there. Almost. I'm probably going to bring over... Julian. I think I'll let Julian try to get the kill. Or I might try Gordon getting the kill again. I mean, it's kind of my go-to move. I keep trying to give him opportunities to be not terrible, and he keeps squandering said opportunities. Each and er a time. I'm going to send Draug up to the top. I, I think that's fine. What kind of weapons do you have? I'm going to give you the steel sword, too. I know it's his weapon that he actually uses, but I think it's fine. Give that over to you. Alright, I think that's fine. Alright, guys and gals. End the turn one last time. Deal with whatever chicanery he pulls out, and then drop him, and then that's where the episode ends. So, like I said, a little bit of a longer one. Went for Navar. Navar dodged. It's fine. Uh, I mean... Well, uh, let's just get out of his way here in a minute. He's not even hurt, really, so he can just do whatever he wants. Let's get him over here. And let's see if Julian can take the kill or if he's going to be short. Two damage, two damage, he did it. He got the kill. Not enough to level up, but hey, you know what? It's okay. Anyway, folks, that's it for now. And the next episode will be... I don't know exactly where we'll be, but I will be playing and doing all the uh, chicanery between things. And we'll hopefully be ready to move on. We'll take down the last guy and move on to the next area. I'm going to go and play Super Inventory Manager. Uh, 2021 and see if we can't get everybody outfitted with stuff that they need slash could use a little bit better. I am a little concerned about possibly having enemies coming out of these spots. So I may actually leave a few folk up over here. Anyway, I'll let you guys know how it all, all plays out. But essentially, instead of, again, keeping like an entire episode of me just going and moving a guy here to do this and go over here to get the convoy and this and that and so on and so forth, I'm just going to try to do it all basically off camera so you guys don't have to watch all that stuff. All right, folks, till the very next episode, I have been your host, Bumpy McSquiggums. Thank you so much for stopping by the Freak Show. And always remember, we play, we fight, we conquer.